Hello everybody, welcome to CCL Season 54, first round match between Dara Yawus, as we like to say, with his halflings, and Hannibal Barca 9. Um, Dara, Dara had a halfling chef which took zero rerolls as one of his inducements, just to get that in right quick. Obviously he's got Deep Root and Zara as well, and in the booth is Daedalquist. Hello! Hello! Yeah, uh, this is uh, this is a big one because, like, uh, as you may or may not be aware of, like, there was an extra incentive for playing Stuntis this season, uh, the with an extra bonus prize for uh, for going furthest with Stuntis. And uh, without spoiling anything, one uh, Stunty team has already uh, done done the big one and uh, and upset someone. So uh, double incentive for sorry Dora here to uh, to pull something out of the of the bag, but. Not easy against Norse, they are exper expert um, stunty hunters with the starting with block on everyone and they have three mighty blow to, to help them out. But they are AV7 so the uh, the flings with their three mighty blow and uh, some uh, decent fouling could uh, could just as easily pitch clear the Norse. So so yeah, it could be, could be a one-sided affair here either way. Um, interesting. Right? Yeah, yeah, that's the thing. Uh, yeah, Norse, obviously, yeah, the, you know, bl block frenzy. Also, the linemen tend to take tackle because they've already started with block. There's not a lot of good choices for them. But, yeah, yeah. as you say, the armor seven leads to them getting, you know, they can be diced pretty easily as well. So, yeah, it's, it's a very high rolly affair. Um, yeah, and we've already seen, seen two huge things, right? Uh, as you mentioned, like, the the flings took zero rerolls. That is... Uh, that is very rough for the flings, but they do get to start on offense, which is uh, very important uh, normally for the Norse too. But zero removals of the LOS. Not what you want to see if you're Dora. <laughs> it's pretty tragic. Oh, lovely bit of sidestepping. Ah, uh, yeah. Dodge doing a thing as well, because no tackle on that old. Mm. No, Berserker, I mean. Like, yeah. Oh. Yeah. So there's a strength four tackler here. This really good, really good runner here. Strength four, edge four. Mm -hmm. uh, leap with dodge and leap, yeah. But only two tackle on the uh on the nice team. But yeah, some frenzy as well. And yeah, he knocks down a thing, but it didn't die. It <laughs> did not die. And a blood yeti, so if that yeti can get hits, there's no guard oh there's one guard on the Norse team. But if the Yeti can hit trees, um, that's really good, isn't it? Kind of weird that he's Yeti. blodged, though, right? If his block might, he'd yeah, he'd he's be better. <laughs> difficult to knock down, but he is AB7, so if he does get knocked down, he's probably gone. Yeah. Going that sidestep leads to this 2D, which does nothing. Got to be wary of the jump up, of course. Are we going to go for a foul? Yes. <laughs> I mean,. Oh, sorry, I'm gonna sneeze. Uh, uh, oh, I thought you were gonna right? mute when you said that. <laughs> I, thought, I thought I was as well, I thought I did. <laughs> Must have pressed the wrong. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I must have pressed the wrong key by it. Incredible. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least you were warned, guys. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No, it doesn't go for the foul. That's uh, mm, that's a bit rowdy. I think uh, he, he went as for the foul. He failed, on, you... he failed the dodge. He failed the dodge from the fling. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Well, well, yeah, because he. he... Oh. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, because he needs to start snowballing, right? And um, well, now the Norse are uh, starting it. Um... Yeah, uh, this is the fourth game of the day, Pedro. There have been some, there have been some good ones, yeah. Oh, you. You banged them out when I was sleeping. <laughs> mm. Well done. Thank you. It's a bit sad. <laughs> That's the only thing I wanted to do all week. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is it? Are we getting the Yeti Blitz? No, we're getting a 1D block. Oh, he's already blitzed. Yeah. Okay, I, I hate, I hate that. I hate, I hate that old fit, but hey. Yeah, I mean... Whatever, he didn't get any rerolls stolen. Might as well spend them somehow. Yeah. Not what I would have done, but you know. 
Oh, Dara is getting absolutely nothing, and that tree is taking root as well while lying down, so... No, no, it's just taking root. Uh, the other one's lying down. Yeah, this was a pretty fucking awful turn of your Dara. Um, no offense. Yeah. It just was. He's got the blitz, okay, he's not... Yeah, he could have blitzed first, right? He could have blitzed first with... Uh... No, he's blitzed with the deep root. It did oh, nothing. Deep root's blitzed. Oh dear. So he's just gonna have. He's just gonna put loads of players here. Yeah. To protect that corner. Which, that he, way. which he has. And right? a stab fails. Holy fudge. <laughs> Holy fudge. There you go. This is a bit of a dicing thus far. Mm-hmm. A more subtle dicing, because like obviously he's seen all his players die, but. Yeah, you, it really sucks that he's removed nobody. He's, yeah. he's got no re-rolls gained. And and, uh, and and now he's boxed in, right? Um, because the, the tree's not doing much. Um, he's uh, it, The pressure is really mounting on, uh, on him. Um, for one gone. Mm. Yeah, it's rough. It's really rough. Deep Root might be forced to throw the fling in a tackle zone here. Uh, and uh, Hannibal realizes that. Um, puts one Norseman back. Yeah, yeah, I don't hit. I don't hit the toss. No, I think uh, I think it's the only thing that you you can do. <laughs> and the uh, the rooted tree is too far back, so that can't really throw it either, because it's just gonna get hunted down from the from the safety. Yeah, yeah. Really good deep root. Oh, makes the landing. Is he in range? Uh, yes. uh, I think he is. Yeah, because uh, sprint. He's got sprint, yeah. Makes the first U fight, makes the second, and <laughs> makes the last one. <laughs> yeah, sweet. And yeah, this is this is the absolute biggest uh, difference between the flings and the uh, the goblins right the the TTM is so much more reliable with the uh, with the uh, trace not nearly making nearly as many checks because they're not hungry and they're not stupid um, and, uh, and they, they also arm. start with strong arm yeah yeah they're so. way way better though, though the, the movement is crucial right like if he didn't it, have sprint a goblin would have yeah. been in range and a halfling wouldn't have, but yeah, yeah, that yeah. is why they get sprint. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I mean, I usually take a sprint on my ball carrier as well. Um, or, no, I usually take sure feet first, um, but you can't do that with the flings, right? You need to take sprint on your carrier. Yeah, they, need, they need sprint, it's just so slow. Yeah, yeah. Shockingly slow, really, halflings. <laughs> That's, it's funny because, like, you know, you'd think on a stream, like, on a team with, like, 8 strength 2, or not 9 strength yep. 2, but uh, usually 8 strength 2, or 7 or 8, or, seven, or 9. Between 7 and 9 strength 2 players, you'd think the strength 2 would be the, the bad thing, but it's just movement 5 is just so yeah, fucking yeah. slow when you've got, like, nothing else. Like, obviously, movement 5 is okay if you're a black orc, well, no, an orc biggin, or, like, you know, dwarves and stuff, but when you're just yeah. a strength 2 weed... Like, obviously, the skinks are a million times better than goblins. <laughs> and uh, that, that movement is just huge on weak players. Yeah. There no, was a lot of adjustments, right. Galentia, yeah. I mean, I don't know how many, but a lot. Yeah, Deep Root, Zara, Chef, Wizard, and Babe. <laughs> <laughs> a couple. <laughs> <laughs> and it doesn't seem that much on the Norse to, like, justify that. No, uh, but flings are cheap, um, like uh, as a base, and these are very like we talked about how Rick's uh, goblins were uh, basically min maxed and and uh, very efficient, right? And this is the same kind of team uh, the flings got. Like they got almost no level ups, barring the uh, the super fling. Yeah. Um, they got two side steppers and. Two levels on the trees? No, three. three yeah. Um, so, so yeah, they're very lean, and uh, yeah, for flings that uh, that really shows in terms of how many use, uh, inducements they get. 
Yeah, it's probably got more fan factor, right? That was another good thing about Rick's only having the four fan factor. Right? Oh, yeah, yeah, that's true. It's <laughs> probably got like about eight or nine or something. <laughs> yeah. And the, the Norse, they have two strengths, so that's already 100k, and then uh, one Agi. So, like, the Norse blow it up pretty quickly as well. Um, yeah. And they, they have a couple of doubles on top of oh. that, so. I ruined. Oh, man. No, my God. Double one. Oh yeah, also no yeah. boner as well on the trees, right? So yeah, trees compared to trolls is embarrassing. Yeah, really. yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's yeah, actually it's, embarrassing how much better they It's are. one of my, my absolute biggest gripes. I, it's why I hate flings. Uh, out of pure jealousy. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and hate, hate red for the rules writing team. Uh, <laughs> because it's fucking despicable. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if... I think despicable might be a bit far, but... um. It's certainly a bit ludicrous that like they're not actually loners, right? Is somebody? But I never yeah. really thought of like loner meaning there's one, right? Until somebody pointed out to me, and it's like, oh yeah, there's actually like big guys. There's loner because they're the only positions with one, right? Uh, you know, stuff like war dancers and assassins and runners. They all have their own zero to two, and then yep. tree men are zero to two, so they don't have loner. And so that made and I never thought about it because I just thought, oh, well, they're big guys, so big guys aren't good at playing with a team and stuff, right? But actually, yeah. it was because they were loners, and 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 then bizarrely, trolls, you know, they're not loners. You've got two of them, and yet they're still yeah. not loners. It's terrible. And and then they have the fucking nerve to change it, but they change it to loner three plus. Like what the <laughs> fuck? Take it away, or change the trees to loner three plus. Why wasn't he in a cage? That's pretty weird, isn't it? You thought you'd just put him one over and just be in the cage. Like if you're gonna make a cage for somebody, but why not put him in it? Yeah. <laughs> like, it seems a bit weird. Oh, yep, trees removed. Don't really want to get your tree stuck on like a bludger, obviously, but I guess splatting yeah, them is pretty good. <laughs> yep. <laughs> As I said, if he does get to punch it and does knock it over, it's going to leave the pitch, and it certainly did. <laughs> I don't think so, Steve. No, I mean, may maybe people can. I mean, well, yeah, okay, so I, I, <laughs> I don't think so, but, you know, I'm not technically minded at all, so maybe somebody like Elliot or whatever could uh, could do something like that. But, but it's not in the base thing. For it. I don't know anything. <laughs> I'm not a computer nerd, believe it or not. So Dara's just letting... Letting Hannibal Bartha score here. Yeah, not really much he can do to stop it at this point, so very fair. Uh, just going for banging out as much as possible to... To then have a shot in the second half. Mm. I mean, custom sound effects on, on Fumble would be pretty great. Yeah. It would actually be pretty great. Like, a lot of the sound effects are good on Fumble, don't get me wrong. All except that, ooh, that's gotta hurt. That's really the, that's probably the worst sound effect I've ever heard in my life. I, uh, didn't hear it. Yeah. It was just a joke, because PC did it. Alright. <laughs> I was hoping you'd know, but never mind. I didn't hear what the sound effect was. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. You know, the... Okay. Okay. No, no, no. I didn't. No. Yeah. Because yeah. they did have sorry. they did have Bruce Campbell doing it, but then if, like you know they just had the sound effect like the clip from Bruce Campbell saying it. But of course that's copyright, so you can't have that. So they got that's rid of weird. it, and they got they got PC to say, "Oh, that's gotta hurt," <laughs> <laughs> which he did very well. Easy does some things well. Yep. Sorry, there's not a whole bunch to going on uh, right now in the game. <laughs> yeah, PC does loads of things. We'll, uh, you know, we can list them all right now. Yep. <laughs> all, all of the, all of, all of the things talk. PC does well. G give us a minute. <laughs> <laughs> It talks a lot, that it does well. <laughs> oh yeah. Very good at talking non-stop. 
Yeah. Are we done? <laughs> <laughs> I think so, yeah, I think that's about. <laughs> Covers it. <laughs> <laughs> Just about covers PC's contribution to planet Earth <laughs> over the last over the last two hundred and seventy years. <laughs> I, I genuinely thought he was older than that. Uh, I heard rumors he was there when they discovered fire, but mm. might have been rumors. Uh, Ooh, I'm surprised that stab. Surprised about that stab. Yeah. Really surprised. Oh, gets the power on the blocker! But he doesn't remove the AB stakes. Disgusting. Here comes the boot. No one assists. Yeah, and gets the Doesn't make it on the reroll. Yeah. yeah. Sent off. That's all. Oh my god. I was surprised about the foul, honestly, with all those removals. Like. I guess the, they, you, they've only got 12, but... You sort of have to high roll your way back in. I, I understand it. Oh, he's um, on the 6 as well. It's, he's yeah, yeah, exactly. Six. Yeah, and it's the tackle dodge. Um, it's such a juicy foul. Uh, you can't hit this because it's 2 into 1. Oh my god, he does it. Wouldn't it? <laughs> Not what I would have done. Uh, me neither when, uh, you know, it's uh, turn eight. Yeah. <laughs> the uh, greed level is uh, insane. Yeah, like he's <laughs> armor <at> ten. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the, the problem with the stab, Ducky, was like they're getting surfed, right? But it, it all worked out with him doing the things like that like he managed to protect the Zara but like it could have easily just happened that like Zara was surfed right and I didn't, didn't like the fact that Zara could have been surfed. Thanks Plo. Uh, hey. now that Dimmy is in here. Um, hey. Anyway the chef gets gets two rerolls this time. Oh that's that's huge. Um because uh a turn drive things could go wrong. Things should go wrong even for Norse against planes in you know, in eight turns but there aren't that many flanks left, is there? Um, He's got one reserve one, still. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, all right. All right. I, then it was l way less uh, removals than I thought. I thought he took more of a beating. Um, yeah, I did as yeah. well, to be honest. So, no, that, with that in mind, that foul becomes a lot better, doesn't it? Because I'm a six. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And... Definitely. Um, <laughs> and uh, and yeah, I mean the the, uh, the main goal is to score um, turn uh, turn eight, uh, right? Um, for the uh, flings, like throw the fling uh, back. Um, I'm surprised he's feeling the good fling. Honestly, I guess he's got the wizard, hasn't he? He's got the wizard. Yeah, so yeah, I guess that yeah. encourages you to feel the good fling. And that so and the fact that he he does feel the full set of links. Um, otherwise, he would have benched it in case he couldn't feel the full set of links, right? Well, I mean, he would... I don't know what you mean. I mean, he could bench it. He could bench it. He literally could bench it. So yes, it's, yes. It's, it's, it's only the fact that... The, like, it must be the wizard, right? It must yeah, be yeah. the wizard. Is what he's feeling. Mm. And even with the wizard, I'd still be tempted to not field him. <laughs> just to just to be sure I've got the throw teammate chance. Like, because the throw teammate... But the throw teammate isn't for the win, though, is it? And the wizard is for the win. And, exactly, exactly. And flings really don't want to have to go to overtime if they can help it. Ooh, doesn't stab. This is the first time he doesn't stab, and it's equally ineffective. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Yeah, Fucking I guess so if, she, if she stabbed, she'd be left on him, right? And he's strength four, mm. so strength four tackle. So yeah, I had, yeah. I had to just blitz him. Yeah. Really wanted to get. Really wants to get a tree on that strength four tackle, doesn't he? Yeah, that's why he goes to great tackle here. Lovely. Very rowdy, uh, but you have to be as the flingers here. You are. Uh... You're chasing. Uh... Yeah, the three plus was pretty was pretty rowdy, but I mean that is what you want, right? You want. Yeah. 
And without Loner, like, it's not bad, and he has four rerolls, but, uh... Yeah, I like that. I like that play. Did he forget about this guy last turn, I wonder? <laughs> <laughs> Must have, right? <laughs> Just as an offensive safety. <laughs> In case things go really south. <laughs> No, he moves him up, so definitely forgot him. <laughs> yeah, I think, I think maybe. I <laughs> maybe he forgot him. Does have the six dice, but no tackle. Doesn't get him. <laughs> and gets a dodge. Oh. And the old dodger and the other dodger. I don't, I don't like that basing all right, because that's just giving him a two D to put him back on the tree. Sorry, they're shooting fireworks here, and allies not a big fan. And a blitz there to put him on the tree. Yeah, that's nice. Could have uh, put in this fling first, right? So then could have uh, chained the other one onto the power, but then I guess... Oh, yeah, no, that would have been super nice. Mm. But then you're really relying on the pal. Uh... Well, you still got this other one to clear up anyway, which... Oh, yeah, that's true, that's true. I didn't hear it. It was an idea, but this is really nice, isn't it? Now he's got two on the tree. Really nice. And moves that... Oh, yeah, moves that before the hit, which is fine. Because you just need him stuck on the tree, right? You don't need to knock him over. You just need you just need players taken out by being in the tackle zone of a strength six guy that they can't do anything to. <laughs> yep. Halflings are, are really interesting in terms of like I think kind of like blood bowl theory. Like when you're playing them, do you know what I mean? Like or playing against them in in terms of like all the tackle zones are the same, right? Like whether you're yeah. strength two or strength six, it's still just yeah. eight squares and stuff. So like the screens, like a, a, a halfling screen is just as good as like a legend chaos warrior screen. And yeah. then, <laughs> and then you've got things like, uh, you know, the trees obviously don't need to hit. They just need to occupy players. Like, you know, th this guy's two for one in these, he's two for one in these, he's two for one in these, and there's no way they can deal with him. Unless it's uphill blocks or dodges, so it's it's pretty it's all pretty cool. Yeah, no, it's uh it's the same with uh, goblins, but they're way shit at it. But yeah, it was one of the things I I really found interesting as well when I started playing, and why I played a million games of goblins. <laughs> yeah, they really show you how unimportant strength is at the same time as showing just how important it is. <laughs> yep, yep, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Super interesting. Is there a hit on the ball here? I believe there is. Let's uh, let's pause it. One, and the two, same thing. Four, five, six, seven, eight. So there is a two D on two GFIs. Mm. Oh, well, not two D. Sorry, a stab on two GFIs if he wants to go for it. But then it really opens up getting served. Yeah. And then uh, it also shows you how important general access is. Um, that was the biggest thing after uh, after I went on to play. Uh, Normal races is just what a luxury it is to have access to general skills. <laughs> yeah, that's that's the thing with ogres, right? Like that's why I wouldn't take strength on ogre ogres because yeah. they just they, they're so starved of normal like general yeah. access skills. They just have to they have to take blocks because they they, they otherwise they're never going to get like tackle basically. Yeah. Block and pro uh, on on big guys that have to, to make rolls to move. Pro is just such a good, uh, such a good skill. Mm, better in Blood Bowl three, of course. Right? Yeah. yeah. That, although that will never be playable, of course, Blood Bowl three. So. <laughs> uh, but theoretically. Yeah. Fumble. Oh, another one gone. Put his 
sidestep up again. Leading this uh, leading this Zerker and we're getting too deep. What did it give him? Oh, I think he doesn't want him there, I think he wants him up here. Yeah. Probably should have done that dodge first. Yeah, I mean that's that is the thing, isn't he? he does get the ball to runner, so he he just needs to keep his on defense. Really, all Dara has to do is keep his uh, keep his edge four unmolested, and then eventually, when this guy's in range, he can get bolted and the uh, yeah, edge four can dodge past everybody, pick it up. Bob's your uncle. Yeah. Is he gonna double G if I have this this strength? Oh no, he's got his guys out of there. Activating the tree just to go one square feels really bad. Could double G if I had to get on both tacklers. That would be really big brave balls and amazing move. Oh, is he going to do it? Yes, he is. Oh, Very much. Diced oh no, just in oh. time. Oh, dice. <laughs> Absolutely dying. The oh, saddest thing. <laughs> oh, so he went there to give it, to make this a two D. I I preferred going here just to get both strength fours on him. But um, diced comedy mega. Yeah, I said earlier, never make a GF fight. The uh, two puzzles are impossible, and I'm proven right again. Hmm. Oh, there's the reroll gone. Mm. So. But the tackle does get him. Yep. Uncle Hoya de Te is uh, is KO'd. Mm, of course, it's a bloody sneak. And now the runner is in range. But I mean, you don't really mind him scoring this turn, but you could bolt him. One, two, three, four, five. GFI, GFI, throw. So we could, we could see. The bolt this turn. Mm -hmm. That's annoying getting nice to attack as well. Yeah, the bolt the throwing could go, yeah, it could get bolted in the bolt of throwing. This disgusting one, the pal. Yeah, outrageous. So, do you, do you just save now? You've got so few players left. Could just save this, or you bolt. A like, big decision now, I guess, for Dar is: does he bolt this, or is he all in on this guy getting thrown? He does bolt. Yeah, the bolt on the sideline is just so good. In the crowd. Oh, flip me! Oh. <laughs> flip me! And he blitzes the safety. Four. Or a pal. He's really, dead. really should have stood him up first, but hey. No, he's not dead. Disgusting. Oh, tactical one. Yeah, it's green. Oh, yeah, and the one. Oh, but that's on the take route, so I stand up. Yeah, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah. All he needed to do was stand up, right? Um, and. Love this yeah, guy. Runs to the tree, gets thrown. Uh, have to, no, he doesn't have to lob him. He can, he can screen. I was thinking because you couldn't screen oh, yeah, him, just yeah, lob yeah, him. But fine. yeah, he can be screened. Four. And honestly, that tree could move away from the ball. Yeah, I know. <clears throat> it would have been better to just tag him with Sarah, but Sarah being absolutely flipping useless this game. <laughs> yeah. Holy shit, he has been the worst yeah, I've crazy. ever seen Sarah perform. He's been pretty terrible. I don't like this from the Zerker. I mean, he could have gone one, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI, right? That was probably the player. He could have been picked up the ball. Yeah. Is there anyone else that can reach the ball? This guy. Yeah, the downed one. Uh, yeah, all right, so it's blitzing and strong branch. <laughs> yeah. The ultimate top magnet. <laughs> oh my god, it'd be hilarious if he doesn't get him down. No, he's not picking up the ball at all. Oh, okay, what so the ult is, is going to go and pick it up. If he can get that. No, he can't. This is just so weird. Oh, that is... <clears throat> that is 
squad magna that that looks because now like the other trees free right so do you throw do you throw here this is the question is is the, so is the player here because like obviously this guy can't just run right he can't just run because he'll get he'll get run down but all he could do is he could pick it up, hand it back off, and then he could throw him, right? Or the other the other fling could hand off to this edge four, which would be... Well, it's it's yeah, two, three I, either way, so yeah, this other fling goes one, two, yeah, three, four, I, five. Yeah, exactly. You pick it up, hand off to super fling. Yeah. And then he loves him, and then he scores. This could be it. Yeah, I think that's the that's what I would do. Uh, probably. Or he could try Strong and screen grand. somehow. It's, oh, he's got... Oh, cool. Jump up, jump up, Zara. He can screen it. He can screen it. He's got Zara. Yeah, yeah, you can scream with Zara. It's okay. Oh. No! Oh. Glorious jump up. Ugh. Stop fucking fighting Stop everything! Stop showcasing ah! everything. <laughs> <laughs> Holy fuck, she's bad. Yeah, I, d I just like blitzing with the tree and then like using Zara to guaranteed screen. Yeah. Because the tree has the G if I the screen as well. Yeah, yeah. I, I like just, just getting the screen in place and then blitzing with the tree. Even though the tree would have sculled. <laughs> and Zara didn't. Um... <laughs> Brilliant sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> um, it is often. I mean, it's about fifty-fifty, Pedro. But it's I, it's just more noticeable, right? Because like you know, if the team has to get lucky to stand a chance. Yeah, why isn't he hitting the ball? Oh my god, yeah, this is... That sweet, deep penetration of my voice is the only penetration I've done in years. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> How could he blitz the screen? I'm trying to use my uh, Discord on my phone and I keep bobbing it. I don't mean, any, I don't mean to be rude or anything like that, me jumping in and out. Hello, <laughs> <Just>, Goliath. Sorry. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. How's it going, boy? Not very Sorry, I, I, I've literally lost interest in Blood Bowl since <laughs> Blood Bowl 3 got released. Yeah, it's pretty much killed it. It's pretty much killed it. I think the word is, uh, I think the ideal word for it is pants. <laughs> yep. Three pants. Absolute yep. pants. Yeah. Not a delicate. Idle quest. So. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I've been lurking in your streams, Jimmy, like recently, so mm. I'm still there, mate. <laughs> it's great. Hang on. Oh. <laughs> Savage did the lovely picnic with a field. <laughs> anyway, there you go. Bizarrely, Hannibal Barca didn't hit the Agility Force fling, who then rolled a couple of two pluses to score. That is wild, isn't it? That, what a. That's weird. But Hannibal Barca is new to new to chalices, so you know, could be him qualifying. Glorious. Uh, no, I won't give in what he needs. until I'm Whoa. victorious. And I will defend. I will really defend. Goodbye. Alright, mate. Well, I love you and leave you anyway, but um, yeah, I've been around, man. I just like, I'm, I'm lurking a lot, so. Um, but, uh. Alright, uh. I'm still using this Discord on my phone, so what am I telling? <laughs> right, okay. Well, <Right. laughs> see you later, guys. Take it easy. <laughs> see you later. See you. <laughs> Glorious. <laughs> um, yeah, fumble. I'm going to do a bit of fumble soon. Yeah, exactly. Half the teams weren't even 70. It was, it was, it was not the best. It, like it's sad, right? Because obviously the, it was really cool, like the the sponsoring and stuff, to try and generate a bit of interest and what have you. But uh, ultimately, it was still just not. A, uh, I mean, it did generate interest, right? It was just bit, uh, not uh, on the levels of uh, a year ago. Yeah, exactly. Uh, you know, 
there's so many, so many teams. Like, you know, two people haven't played their two people haven't played their first round match. Loads of people didn't accept tickets. Loads of the qualifications were like, you know, some of the worst qualifiers we've had. Like not in terms of the coaches or anything, I'm not being mean, but like in terms of the records, some of the worst qualifying records, like Rick with his four and all goblins. Um so yeah, it's but you know, it is cool that it's a send off, right? It is cool that it's a send off. Yeah. And I mean, there are still loads of great coaches in there, right? Yeah. Um, we got to see a first round match between two of the greatest of all time in, in level two, um, in Chunter versus Cruz, right? So. Mm. Yeah, that was an incredible first round game. Yeah, it's just. Yeah, it's just as good as it is. Dio was here for a bit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Dio versus Devo, yeah. Dio versus Devo was an unbelievable. unbelievable yeah. Match. Yeah, speaking of two of the all time greats on, on on maybe two. We had two of those games in round one. Mm. So yeah, well, it was it was it was great. It was great the uh, sponsorship. It's just it's just a bit sad that like you yeah. know the interest didn't go that much, but yeah. What what we got was good. <laughs> mm. I just meant like there there are still like a lot of good coaches that came back for it. Um, yeah, yeah. Well Chris so, uh, Chris being the biggest one. Yeah, yeah. With an unbelievable team, he's probably got the mm, very close to the best team in there. And, uh, yeah, and uh, very just close a, to the hardest draw. <laughs> just, just a normal yeah. cruise team. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's unbelievable the consistency of cruise, like uh, unbelievable. Yeah. But um, there you go. Congratulations. <laughs> we just glossed over the ending here. Where yeah, the well, it was over, right? It was, <laughs> it was over. It was too. It was too. Yeah, it was. It was. It was, it was, it was there you go. Uh, right. Congratulations, Dari Yawus. Uh, obviously, it's pronounced differently, but you know, I like to say Dari Yawus. And congratulations <laughs> to Hannibal Barca. Uh, but you know, good, good, good for him qualifying. And thank you, Dadel. Glorious core commentary. Yeah, thank you so much. And and honestly, what a big turnaround from the Flames. Uh, mm. They were. Almost down and out, and then you sideline cage against them, and uh, that was exactly why you don't sideline cage against the wizard. Yes, um, and he displayed exactly why you should blitz an edge for stunty carrier <laughs> yep, yep, and yep, not try to screen against him. <laughs> so there you go, there you go. Uh, Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>